Hey there, in this video we're going to build an effective auto cutoff charger with just two components. This circuit can charge 12 volt to 3 volt battery. All you need to do is adjust the circuit to the battery maximum charge voltage. For lithium battery, we will set the voltage of the circuit to 4.2 or 4.1 volts, which is the maximum charge voltage for the lithium iron battery. When the battery is fully charged, it remains at 4.2 volts and doesn't go above or below 4.2. And for those of you that are not subscribed to the channel, please be sure to do that and hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified if there's an upcoming video. So let's get started. To build this simple circuit, all you need is an IRF3205 MOSFET transistor, or you can as well use an IRF44 MOSFET transistor. And we'll also need a 560 ohm variable resistor and you can also use a one kilo ohm variable resistor. So guys, for this project, we're gonna make use of only two pins of the variable resistor. So we're gonna make use of the middle pin and any of the one from the left or the right. So first we're gonna connect the gate pin of the MOSFET transistor to the first pin of the variable resistor. And then we're gonna connect the drain of the MOSFET to the middle pin of the variable resistor. And then the source of our MOSFET transistor is gonna be our negative output. And then the gate of the MOSFET transistor is going to be our negative input. And so guys, let's put the circuit together and see if it actually works. And so guys, to be able to set the voltage, we're going to connect an LED as a load to the circuit output. And then we're going to regulate the voltage to about 4.2 volts. This is a maximum voltage for a lithium ion battery. And so guys, to see if this circuit actually works, we're going to connect a 4.2 fully charged lithium ion battery to the circuit to see if it goes above 4.2 volts. And so guys, as you can see here, the battery voltage is 4.2. So now we're going to tune our emitters knob to from 200 to 20 on the DC mode. This is done so that we can see any slight change in the voltage. And as you can see here, we have a voltage of 4.14 volts. And as I turn on the power supply, we have a voltage of 4.15 volts. And so guys, as you can see, the circuit actually works. So what we wanna do now is connect a low voltage battery to see if it's going to charge. So now we're gonna hook up a two volt battery to see if it's actually gonna charge. And so guys, as you can see here, as I turn on the power supply, the voltage increases to three volts. So yeah, it actually works. And so guys, if you like this video, support us by subscribing to the channel and give us a thumbs up. And you can also share this with your friends and families. And yeah, you're very correct. This is a voltage regulator. So goodbye.